Hello friends, Philip coming to you from a very wet Chiang Mai, October 2022. Two days ago the River Ping burst its banks in some places and some unlucky um, suburbs got flooded. However I've just been down to the river, I went there yesterday morning and I've been again today and it's about a metre down so we've had no rain for two days so hopefully that's all going to clear up. Now I'm very excited today because just near the river is this amazing temple complex um, and I, I'd like to give you a, a brief tour because it's not, not any ordinary temple. I'm just going to keep quiet for a while because if you're like me the sound of running water is is a joy so I'll just let you listen to that for a bit Wat Ta Nai I that's the name of the temple Chiang Mai carefully make my way through this gap. Uh, so that's the way in. Now you can see two Thai people making merit with their incense sticks in front of one of the Buddha images. Let's just walk towards them a little bit, give you a better view. This is very typical in Thai temples. I wonder if you can sit down on your legs like that, eh? flexible bodies. I'm very lucky. I've come today off the cuff and I came here a couple of years ago and it was very busy. Today I've got the place almost to myself. Now, can you see those pieces of wisdom there? Don't put all eggs in one basket. Very good advice. And look at this. Doesn't matter about your age. It is never too late to mend. Let's have a look at this Buddha image, it's beautiful. So many of them here. And I love bamboo.
sure about that, to reap what others have sown. It actually fits with my understanding of collective karma, that what you do has an effect on me, because the whole of humanity sails in one ship. That's the, one of the disasters of our modern life, is that we all think we're separate. We are individual, we are unique, but we're also as one. We're both. Let's go back to where I started, because there's another part to the complex that I want to show you. Look at this fella here. And these three, these three chaps, reminds me of the Hindu gods. Is this the white elephant? I can't quite remember. And there's the biggie. Sunshine. I think there's a mosquito biting me, but I'm holding my camera. I'll have to get bitten. Come through to another section. I remember a bit of a garden round here. I'm just going to take you, show you this, and then we'll finish off in the garden. That's beautiful. There's trees everywhere. There's the flowing water, the streams, all the Buddha images, all the brickwork and because it's the rainy season there's so much life everywhere. You can hear we're coming to the main road. Now these are, what are these called? These are the, um, the trees that Bud the Buddha uh, sat under for many years I think it was as the tale goes. Uh, I, can't, I can't remember the name of the tree for a moment. Lots of them, huge things they are. Now, let's just go through to this garden. We've got competing noise, but you'll have to forgive me. I don't know who she is or what she signifies, but you get a sense of the tranquility here. All the lovely gardens and the images, and all well kept and kept, and just trees and shade and sunshine, and up there is the universe. Let's just come around here and show you this. Look at that, eh? Right, I'm just going to walk away, walk away from the traffic, take you back here, and then uh, end the video. Back where we started, I think. I read in another temple the other day something like wherever you find money, you find trouble. Okay. Well, this is a temple tour that's over now, coming to you from Philip in, in a wet Chiang Mai. Luckily the rain's held off for two days. Um, if you're enjoying my channel, 
then can you please subscribe to it or leave me a comment uh, I'm still a small man on on social media so I can always personally reply to you uh, click the like button and all of that stuff because it boosts me up in the YouTube algorithms and I can grow my channel beautiful eh checking out from the temple have a good day